enjoy it while you can. Enjoy it today. You're still here. Hello, hello, hello everyone. This is Cynthia Toa, Miss Flipping, your gypsy medicine woman and your inspirational coach here to do a reading for the cancer in the house today. Ooh, let's see what the cards have to say for the beautiful cancer out there today. Let me change my screenshot here and get this camera working here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, now let's see what the cards have to say for the cancer in the house today. This is for the month of February. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's the cards have to say? Oh, union, a partnership, coming together, exciting times. This is having an exciting time with your life. <laughs> Whether you got somebody there or not, you're still enjoying life. Life is a party. <laughs> life is a party. Ooh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What else going on? And yeah, there is a balancing act going on. This is a, something's coming to balance, you know. So you're able to operate with your higher emotions and your lower emotions that they're in balance with each other. So you're able to actually be happy all the time <laughs> and when something's coming in fast what's coming in fast some fast moving action something's coming in fast let's see what it's going to be what is coming in fast mm -hmm. let's see there's too many cards there i know if it's supposed to come out it'll come out again <laughs> yeah yeah Ooh, it's kind of, there's some there's some travel plans there's somewhere to go you, you know it's like you want to go there with someone it's like you you're ready you're ready you know you're supposed to go somewhere you know you're supposed to be traveling somewhere but it's almost you're like you were expecting somebody to go with you maybe you'd be traveling alone <laughs> what's going on with the cancer in the house for the month of february Ooh, there was a divine masculine his heart's up pounding Ooh, somebody's got a hold of his heart he's feeling light he's feeling floaty <laughs> yeah he's never felt this way before <laughs> yeah what's coming forward <laughs> Oh, the best, and he worries, she worries. There's worry there, there's doubt, there's insecurity. Oh no, is this really happening? But there is, you know, this is the, the bird that, you know, <laughs> and this is the thought that's going, yeah, this is really going on, that feeling. I'm really feeling that feeling. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So it is unconditional love this is a divine masculine he's full of love he has nothing but love to offer that's all he has to offer <laughs> is a lot of love that's coming from his heart chakra mm -hmm. yeah what's going on what's going on with the cancer in the house mm -hmm. it's a wish it's a dream not just well not just a wish not not just a wish and a dream that you know the cancer put out that other people have been wishing for the cancer to you know be able to find probably to be able to find this love within themselves so they're not worrying so much and allowing their their hearts to really go pitter patter really feel what that feeling is to feel that feel you know what else what else going on with the cancer in the house for the month of february Ooh. yeah they've been doing a lot of work they're working and working and working whatever they're working on they got their back turned to the rest of the world because they don't you know they want to make sure that they're falling deeply and completely in love with themselves mm -hmm. with the cancer see lots of self-love so far that's what i see <laughs> Yeah, lots of self-love going on. Enjoying life because life is becoming more in a balance by taking time to taking time to be with yourself to do the inner work, you know. It's the inner work is being divinely led. It is being divinely guided. <laughs> yeah. Divine wants to make sure we're operating from laughter and play and, and being grounded, being whole, being complete, being joyful. Mm -hmm. Yep. And there has to be a tower moment for it to happen, for the butterflies to come out. The butterfly is, you know, after the cocoon, after being in the cocoon long enough, after they've done enough healing on the inner, inner self, doing the self-care work, that's when the butterfly really gets to come out and they get to start over. That's when you get to start over with a brand new, fresh start where you're not thinking about what it is that you're going to do next. You're going to just go do it like the child, like mine. The child doesn't think about things it's not thinking about what's going to happen tomorrow they're thinking about the now let's enjoy the now <laughs> no fear the child has no fear so 
So it looks like there's a lot of self-care going on in the month of February that's actually going to make a breakthrough because you guys have taken the time to do the inner work. You've been taking the time to do the inner work so you can feel this happiness and this glee, whether anybody comes around or not, but you're feeling how your heart is vibrating from within by allowing all the doubts and insecurities and all those lower vibrational stories, letting them go by unconditionally loving them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, to bring a balance within, to bring a balance within your life would bring a balance within your journey. Yeah. Self-love is the best love. I mean, when you love yourself, guess what? Then you got a love partner for the rest of your life. <laughs> yeah. You don't have to worry about seeking it because you are the love. Mm -hmm. That's where it starts. All right. Mm -hmm. It's written in the book that whatever's going on with you guys, it's written in the book to make your life more lighter, more easier, but to make the movement be more simple. And uh, you have been guarding yourself. You've been protecting yourself. You have to guard yourself and protect yourself. It's more, more protection of self when you're doing the inner work. You know, that's what they're working on. When you're doing the inner work of the calling of the divine for the butterfly to come out, within we need to have the shield on to protect our souls from any anything else from getting in the way mm -hmm. yeah let's see what else what else is going on yet yeah, because it is all about protecting your heart mm -hmm. it's all about the heart here okay what else is going on for the cancer in the house here for the month of february mm -hmm. self-love joy happiness you know, yeah their passion desire you know it's like it's like this is a month you really really de discover yourself this is the month you, you really you know are you know are able to unleash something that has been locked up within and it is a passionate side of you it is a a a, a um, part that you know used to be hard used to you know used to go and you wonder you wonder how you could have this feeling all the time but all of a sudden you know these little birdies started talking to you and you're able to see you're able to see how to release that old way yeah 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 for the cancer in the house for february it, it, you know, it is a, a will of fortune change. It's your change. Your life is changing for the better. It, and it's divinely guided. It's divinely led. The change is from divine. What else? Again, balance. It's like this is this is when we have to or the child, the child when we were young, you know, we knew that that we were taken care of every day. We trusted the universe had our back. We didn't worry about the next day. We it's like the inner work that had to be done is to go back to a time that you felt like everything had your back so you could bring that feeling forward into your adulthood space. And it is been a, something that has to be balanced within your inner so for those for those wings to come on so it has been it is about balancing the emotional self so you're actually um that's what the self-love is about you know take and taking care of the heart in the process so the universe can truly offer you a brand new beginning something solid something grounded something whole something complete something that makes you feel like you can make that chess piece move that you're all four kings in one that you you know they're solid they're grounded they're whole they're complete they can make wise decisions they can make choices so they can be so they can be operating from a victory estate so this is you know you embracing everything within that allows you to shine and when you're shining your best you know everybody else feels that shine from within this is Cynthia Toa Miss Flip It You're a Gypsy Madison Woman and your inspirational coach I do go live every Monday and Thursday nights for your hidden love story right here on this channel where I do give um uh, readings out paid and free and the only difference is if the paid get to go first and the free have to wait in line <laughs> and until next time bye bye butterflies see you later catch woo, 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 woo.